it is day seven of the 369 cleanse. Um, I just got our lemon waters together and then I'm gonna get all of our other morning stuff prepped. Today is gonna look pretty much like the previous days as far as food goes, but we will bring in a second celery juice today, which we're excited about because we used to drink um, two celery juices a day and we just really love bringing in a second celery juice. Okay, so just got a little bit of work done, um, almost done with my lemon water, and now I'm gonna make our celery juice. So tell them what you did today. So we started a new YouTube channel and that Root Life, the one you're watching right now, that channel is going to be more medical medium related content and like vlogs and stuff like that. And then we started another YouTube channel called That Farm Life. And that one is going to be all about like farming and gardening and off gridding it and homesteading it and uh posted our first video on there today so we're gonna try to at least get a video up once a week on that channel and then you know continue on with all the medical medium stuff on that root life and keep sharing all that good information with you guys okay so um i just made us some honey lemon waters for the day I'm um, still waiting for the Berkey to filter out more water for the second one. Um, we use a Berkey water filter because it really gets all of the impurities and nasty things out of the water and gives you like the purest water you can ever have. Um, but then you need to wake that water up, um, like we've told you guys before, by adding in some sort of living thing, so like lemon, lime, orange cucumber something that will then waken it up that way that water then will really hydrate your cells and nourish your body um, so on the cleanse you want to make sure that you are staying hydrated because you are releasing toxins from your liver and you want to keep flushing those out um, so it's best to drink at least 32 ounces of lemon lime water throughout the day um, and that does not include your morning 16 ounce or sorry, your morning 32 ounce and your evening 16 ounce. So this is in addition drinking that throughout the day. So I have these prepped. Um, I have everything in our blender ready to blend our heavy metal detox smoothie. I always stick it in there and then wait to blend it until we're ready to drink it because I find that it um, is just really best flush, freshly blended. Otherwise, it starts to solidify and get like jello-y and harder to drink. Um, which is okay, but I love drinking it freshly blended. So about to blend that, got our waters going. Um, yeah, and then I think we're gonna do the spinach soup for lunch today. Hey everyone. Hey, good morning. It is day seven. Day seven is upon us, yeah. Day yep. seven of the 369 cleanse. We are excited to be on the final push of it. It's been relatively, I feel like, easier than the last cleanses we've done. It has been. We've gotten used to eating pretty much raw. You know, we eat raw pretty much until dinner time. Um, and this advanced cleanse is all raw which is, we've been totally fine. So if it's something you're not used to though, it can be hard um, not, you know, having those cooked foods and those fats and things like that. And we we're used to not having a lot of fat either. So I think that makes it easier too, but we're really enjoying this um, version of the cleanse and really enjoying the new recipes that we're having for dinner. All right, so what are you doing today? So I have, it's, well, it's Friday. I've been looking forward to planting this bok choy today. And I want to plant all this bok choy all over the yard because bok choy, they can be planted <laughs> like so close together 
that yeah you know we could sell them at market if we wanted to yeah but and you're worried because it might start raining right so you're supposed to rain today i didn't know that yep and we got market (laughs) tomorrow which i'm hoping that doesn't rain us out yeah it's all right we've had a rainy market before and we're fine yeah the weather is not cold but usually then not as many people come so that's the only bummer for dinner i think we're gonna do the herb salad um yeah cool it's pretty pretty simple so all right all righty well we're gonna go get on with our days sounds good see ya bye guys all right i'm out here in the microgreen garage and i've got to water some of the microgreens and then i'm going to get outside and try to plant some of this bok choy so we're all done with watering the microgreens next what we're going to do is i've got some peas that i soaked overnight we're going to take these peas get them in some trays and let them sit to, till they're ready All right, we got the peas going. Now what I'm gonna do is go plant some bok choy. So I'm gonna plant some bok choy here in that wine, this wine barrel. The bok choy can be planted about two inches apart, so it should get me a lot of bok choy in here. So first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some amendments, throw some amendments in here, throw some compost, and then mix it all in. So now I'm going to get my compost and throw two shovelfuls of compost in this mix. I got my compost, I threw some peat moss in there as well, so let's dump this in and get it mixed. Alright, here's all my bok choy. So I'm going to put this in the wine barrel here and space it every two inches. just had our spinach soup well like maybe a half hour ago had our spinach soup now I'm prepping and making our second celery juice gonna get that ready to go you wait at least an hour after your soup that way it fully digests um, and then you have your celery juice that way it's on an empty stomach and then after you have your celery juice you'll wait at least 30 minutes before you um, have say an apple as a snack or drink more lemon water. Okay, so I finished up with the planting today. I just finished editing a video. I filmed a video earlier. You'll have to check that one out. It's our top 10 seed companies that we buy from for all our uh, farm and garden seed. And now I want to check in with Ashley and see what she's up to. See how the dinner's coming along. What's going on in here? How's it all coming? Good. I'm almost done. It's a lot of chopping. Oh, I bet. Um, 
What uh, what salad are we going with today? Uh, it's the tomato cucumber herb salad. So I think this is what we had on night one of the cleanse, and now we're having it again on night seven. Cool. So yeah, I got the greens are all tossed with some lemon juice, and then now I'm putting all the toppings in together with some orange juice. Mixing that up, and then it gets topped with it all, and it tastes really good. Alrighty, herb salad is ready. Got all the lettuce and lots of goodies stacked on top. Yay, this is our second favorite meal. Out of the five. Out of the five, this is number two. And we like it. Got like a Greek, a Greek sauce is amazing. <laughs> That's good. Are we eating kind and of then the dill like adds really good flavor to it. Yeah, this was, I couldn't find any fresh dill, so this was dried dill, which I wish that we had fresh, but this will do. All right, sorry it's so late. It's good. Let's get this down and then drink our tea and our water. All right, so we finished dinner. Now we are just drinking. Did you finish your water? Still working on it. I drank my <laughs> I drank my 16 ounces of lemon water. Ben's working on it. We're working on our lemon balm tea. I had an apple as a snack because I felt like it. And Callie's getting all the snuggles. <laughs> and then that'll be a wrap for day seven. Yeah. We have farmer's market tomorrow. Bright and early. So we'll be getting up early for that. Um, and then I guess we'll just see you guys tomorrow. All right. See ya. Say bye, Callie.